I got the million dollar drill. I okay. should be selling this for a million dollars, but I'm giving it to you Ooh, for free. Okay. I got should the million dollar drill. <laughs> Absolutely, because we want people to be better, right? right? So I got the perfect drill that you can do without a club to fix this over the top. Okay. All right, so as I continue on this path to get better at golf, I've identified a couple of flaws in my game, one being oh. my transition. Now, I've worked with countless coaches who have told me that I have an over the top swing. However, this DWIZ device is the first thing that's actually shown it to me with the actual data. And it is eye-opening to see how dramatic I am coming in over the top. So I need to fix this. Today I am here with Lewis Kelly. Lewis, hey, no, great brother. to see you, man. Thanks for having me. Lewis is the playing professional at Golf Mills Golf Club out in Philly. Yep. And my man won the New Jersey State Open last year. So if there's anyone I want to bring in to help me beat Frank in our match that's at the right. end of this series, it's going to be you and I want blood. That's right. right. So That's as I right. said, I, I am off the tee. I'm noticing when I do miss, I miss right. I'm putting a lot of spin on the ball. I'm getting lazy. I know I'm over the top and I just want to fix it because I want more balls in the fairway. And we're going to how solve we, that today. So that's great. I want to know how we're going to use this to solve it and what the result is hopefully going to be. Well, first of all, this is the perfect device to measure that. I don't think anything on the market right now can measure that. So that's number one. Number two, I got the million dollar drill. I should okay. be selling this for a million dollars, but I'm giving it to you Ooh, for free. Ooh, okay. So I got the perfect drill that you can do without a club, so you can work on it at home. Love it. To fix this over the top move. Okay. So we're gonna take some, some swings first to see your swing, and then we're gonna do the drill, and then we're gonna measure it with the DeWiz. Now I love that because all of the coaches I've worked with, all of the drills included the club. So it was a lot of different things with the club. This right. will be the first one without. Right. Okay. And we want to make it as simple as possible, not only for you, but for the folks at home. Love it. All right. All right. So let's get into the DeWiz. We're going to take a couple swings okay. just to measure you. I got the DeWiz on transition, okay, because that's what we're going to work on today. Another thing we're going to work on today is IDDX, which is going to show where the club is coming out in transition, which is going to be perfect. Okay. And for our amateur golfers, what does transition mean and what should the numbers look like? Sure. So the transition means as we take it to the top, where this club's going and pitching out to get to the golf ball, okay? okay? So the classic over the top move is this way, right? And we want to fix that for you to hit it more in the fairway. And is over the top is what's creating that spin? That's correct. Okay. That left to right spin for a right-handed golfer, that sells you in the See trees. you later. Yeah, yep. that's right. Okay. Okay, so let's take a couple swings here. That's a pretty good ball. Plus 3.3. Okay, so the DeWiz says plus 3.3 .3 in inches. So what does that mean? That is the difference from the backswing plane okay. to the downswing plane in inches. So if you see on the avatar that we'll put up here on this side, is that your backswing plane is in green or blue, and it comes over the top, and that distance between the backswing plane and the downswing plane in inches is three inches. We want to try to get it to here, which means you're perfect on plane. So let's hit another one. Okay. So that's the one we want to Plus get. 4 .4. So that was four inches. So we even <laughs> went even more over the top. Yeah. So you ready for the million dollar drill? I need it now. I okay. So I'm going to give yeah. you my driver. You're going to switch. Okay. Okay. This is the million dollar drill, guys. The million dollar drill. Let's hear so it. So here's what we want to do. For a right handed golfer, we want to put our left hand over top of our right hand. Okay, and then we're gonna hook our pointer fingers together. So it's gonna look like this. Let me do it again. So here's how you do it in a golf swing. I got for a right-handed golfer, left hand on top, right hand on bottom. We're just gonna put the left hand over top of our right so you see how that mimics a golf swing. We're gonna hook our index fingers so the back of our hands are kind of touching together. Okay. So once we do that, we're gonna move and act like a golf swing, right? Up, down, in continuous motion. And you're going to tell me what I feel. The down the line camera will show that my backswing plane and downswing plane is on the same thing. Right. So the reason why this is a million dollar drill, number one, you can do this anywhere. In the airport, at mm. the gas station, while you're gassing up your car. Yeah. Right? You can get swings that are going to be as close to a regular golf swing as possible. It looks physically impossible to go over the top doing that. That's correct. So yeah. we're going to show that later. And also, this puts your body in perfect position. So if you notice, I have a nice coil. I feel back in my uh, a stretch in my back here, and I'm a little out of breath. Yeah. So not only is it going to give you a workout, it's going to tell you where you are. It heightens your senses here to get your backswing 
and downswing on the same plane. So why don't you come in here and try that? And I'll help you with that. Perfect. So, so left, left over hand right. over right, pointer fingers hooked. And now I want you to take a golf swing. So do continuous motion there. Beautiful. Ooh, yeah. So, so why don't you get on your right foot when you make your finish? Beautiful. And then tell me what you feel. Let's do this 10 times. It feels more controlled. Like I feel like this is the right swing. I'm, right. I feel like I'm actually hitting up on the ball too. I like that. So if you notice guys from down the line, you can see that his backswing plane, go ahead. Continuous motion. Just want you just flow through just it, flow. right? Just keep flowing. His backswing plane and downswing plane are perfect. Yeah. Not only that guys, he's coiling his, keep going. He's coiling his upper body. So you feel that big stretch here, don't you? Yeah. So totally. in order to hit the drive, not only more accurate, but far, we want to, and you hear that a lot, right? In golf instruction is that you want to get that coil, right? You want to separate the upper body and the lower body. And when you have your hands in this position, that's yeah. why I call it the million dollar drill, right? You see me coiled right here. So then I can unload into the golf ball. And we worked on transition with your buddy, right? right? And this is also gonna help him too to understand the synchronization of the lower body and the upper body and the arms. So why don't we do that 10 more times there? Beautiful. There you go. Now, Lewis, why don't you do it faster too? You say it's the million dollar drill. This is the million Here's dollar Here's the million drill. dollar question. When you put the club in your hand, then what do you do? <laughs> so we're gonna mimic the same thing. So if you can't feel this in your normal swing, we need to do more of these. So when I okay. teach my juniors, gotta do 100 a day. Wow. 100 a day to keep the slice away. Yeah. Okay, that's what we're gonna do. So I'm gonna tee this ball up for you. Why don't you get your driver? Okay. So here's what I'm gonna do. I want you to do it five times fast, continuous motion, without the driver. I'm gonna hand you the driver and you're gonna swing. Go for it. And we're gonna get the DeWiz data and see what we can do. One, good, keep flowing. Two. Three, four, five. That's perfect. Now, with the DeWiz, we can actually measure the difference between the two swings. Plus two point so that, we cut that in two We're inches, there. Yeah. which is huge. Wow. Now, you just got this, yeah. so it's not gonna be perfect. Folks at home, when you guys take a lesson with your local professional, okay, don't think that you're gonna get immediate results right away. This is a hard game. It's gonna take a while. Yep. So you gotta be kind to yourself. Mm -hmm. But we just cut that in two inches, which is this, guys. That's a dramatic That's difference. That's huge. In what, five minutes? Yeah. Right? So the reason why it's called the million dollar drill is that it planes you perfectly downswing and backswing, does things with your pivot, right? Gets you that stretch that everybody wants, that Tiger Woods stretch, mm -hmm. pushes you in a perfect transition and it hits the ball straighter. So let's just talk about this IDDX. The IDDX is the degree that the butt of the club, right? So it's actually measuring the DeWiz, but because we grip it, right? It's gonna to transition to the butt of the club, the degrees that it's coming out of the transition. So when, I mean, we're gonna do this, when you get the million dollar drill here, we're gonna match that degree to where the club is so you can understand what's going on. So. When he had it, it was probably right around 40 degrees, mm -hmm. right? So if we got this T here, out is 90, back is 90, and down, perfectly down is zero, Yeah. right? So we still want this to come out towards the golf ball because the golf ball is over here. It's not over here. Notice how it's still out towards the golf ball, but it's more down than out, mm -hmm. okay? So when I get here and swing, it's going to be more down than out. <laughs> that wow. was pretty good. Wow. What is the rep Soto numbers on that? That's with your driver. 280, not bad, 108 for the first total. swing Casual. of the day. Casual 301 total. <laughs> All right. So we're going to take the million dollar drill, I'll grab your driver, yep. and I'm going to tell you the IDDX number that okay. we have in the million dollar drill here. Got it. Beautiful. Plus so, 0 .8. so not only is that 0.8. So what that means is, is that if this is perfectly on plane, it was just 0.8 yeah. degrees, yep. I mean 0.8 inches. So that was 40 degrees, IDDX. So that came out, right, if we got the T here, mm -hmm. that was 40 degrees out towards the golf ball. Got it. Now, when you hit your normal swing, let's hit a normal swing here, that's probably gonna be twice, twice. that much. 
Well, hopefully not. Hopefully but. not, right? Okay. Ugh. Just getting okay. used to it. Getting used to it's it. It's okay. So that was 56 degrees. Okay. So that was, well, not as twice as much, but that went out excessively out to the golf ball. So when you do your 100 swings a day in the office, mm -hmm. you're going to cut that down to your perfect number of 40 degrees. Now, listen, everybody's different. My build is different from your build, right? Right. So my numbers are not going to be the same as yours. Mm -hmm. So let's do that one more time with the million dollar drill. Beautiful. Plus zero 30.0. Point, I mean, sorry, 0.5 inches. The difference between the backswing and the downswing. Uh -huh. And that was 34 degrees. So that is your fingerprint on where that club needs to come up and down based on your build. Got it. And that's why the Wiz is so great is that we take measurements so it's specific to you and where this the Wiz measurement device is coming out of. So let's hit one more shot. Look at that. <laughs> Get that tracer, baby. Oh, he did. Plus 3.2. So not only was that 3.2 inches, so yeah. we, we started at 4.5, like yeah. right? And we cut it down an inch, people. An inch is huge <laughs> in golf. And wow. our IDDX number was 55, which is closer to your 40 number. Love it. That's why this is the million dollar drill. Great Dude, job, That's bro. awesome. Lewis, I appreciate this. I Thanks. got some work to do over the next 30, 60, 90 days That's and forever. Right. Hopefully this tip helps you guys and uh, we'll see you in the next video.